Rena Dunn, this pro plan field champion was able to handle seven flawless finds to earn a hard-earned victory. In Lexington, Kentucky, the Bluegrass Classic marked its 58th year of Border Collie Trials. And in the end, it was Alice, a female Border Collie owned and handled by Scott Glenn of Alberta, Canada, who took home the championship. Over in Ronan, Montana, at the prestigious National Amateur Retriever Championship, a birthday wish came true for Casey Adams. His seven-year-old Labrador, Lexi, outperformed the competition to be named the National Amateur winner. Not only is Lexi a proud Pro Plan Field champion, but all 15 of these finalists were Pro Plan fed. Those are definitely some incredible dogs, and it all starts with nutrition. And right now, it's time for our next event. Shalene has more. It's a head-to-head -head race where focus and determination are key. 30 weaves down with a 180-degree tunnel turn and 30 weaves back. The first dog to complete the course and cross the finish line is the one that wins. Get ready for 30 weave up and back. This is going to be a fun one to kick it off. Pepper and Kim Fuquay. Vim and Kim Terrell, they battled it out in the large dog agility competition earlier. Kim Terrell and Vim came out on top. Kim Fuquay and Pepper had a great second place finish. Can they get a little revenge here, Shalene, in the 30 weave up and back? We will see neck and neck coming out. Oh, and a mistake on top there by Pepper, but Vim stays on course through the tunnel and is already back into the 30 weaves. This looks like it is going wow. to be Kim and Vim. And a mistake there. Have to correct. They have to do all of the weasels. And here comes Pepper. Who is it? Wow. That was literally a nose-to-nose -nose finish. Right out of the gate, Vim jumped into the weeds quicker, but then we saw mistakes by both of these dogs who are super fast and super skilled at these obstacles. And right up to the end, it was literally a photo finish. But Pepper takes the win and will advance to the final. And who will face Pepper in the final? Will it be Suzanne Bolt and her dog Fable from Calgary, Canada? Or will it be PJ O'Connor and Kenobi from Los Angeles, California? We have a Shetland Sheepdog versus a Border Collie in this race. Small versus large dog, very different styles through the weave poles, but very fast first into the tunnel is Kenobi and back into the weeds. If we don't see any mistakes here and he stays on track, I do believe this will be Kenobi's race to advance. Very nice. PJ O'Connor and Kenobi staying focused the entire way through, Shalene. Truly, that focus is the name of the game. They have such a long set of weaves doing that 180-degree turn in the tunnel, but they have to stay on course. They're used to six or 12 weaves when they're doing agility, and this is very different. So the final is set now. Pepper and Kim Fuquay, Kenobi and PJ O'Connor. Remember, Kim Fuquay and Pepper, second place in the large dog agility competition earlier. Here we go. Both large dogs going through in large dog style with a one step. But look, Kenobi into the tunnel first and back into the weeds. It's going to be tight. They're fast. No mistakes can be made here. Kenobi wow, takes it. And two flawless runs by PJ O'Connor and his dog Kenobi. And settling for another second place finish, Kim Fuquay and Pepper. Very nicely done. From the get-go, Kenobi jumped into those weaves and took the lead and was able to maintain that throughout the entire race. P.J. O'Connor and Kenobi showing focus and stamina. Sean Smith, not an easy task here in the mountains. Avon, Colorado, close to 8,000 feet in elevation, and you guys are running back and forth. What's it like running at this high elevation? I want to have a heart attack. I am very winded. Really tough, really tough up here. But uh, wow, what an event. So much fun. All right, and the dogs are running hard, but you are the new champ. Congratulations, you guys deserve it. Thank you so much. Really want to uh, appreciate you guys, and thank you for putting this on for us. Guys? All right, get some oxygen, boys. Two exciting competitions left. The incredible diving dogs make their way to the Purina pool. Meanwhile, the mountain dogs get ready for their shot here in Avon, Colorado. Stick around. 